We're going to go over how to calibrate the verifier using the calibration card. First you'd go to the menu, then you go to wizards, calibration, verifier. Following the on-screen example, you put the calibration card in. You would load it as if you were loading media. Pay attention to the card. It says front and back, and that's how you want to load it. You want to line the card up to the metal edge over here. After the card is loaded, you want to hit the double arrows. After the calibration process is done, you'll get a message saying calibration passed. Now you're ready to print. We're going to go over how to set up the verifier to void and reprint the label. To do that is very easy. In the top left, you click the menu first. Then you go to settings. Then click on verification settings. There's two menu options. We'll start with verification first. The verification type is set to ISO right now, which is the ANSI standard. And then passing grade set to 3. Aperture is set to automatic, which will work for most customers. And a note, passing grade is ranging from 4 to 0. Next, we'll go to error handling. First is the number of retries. This is the number of attempts the printer will try to reprint a label after failing it. Next is the action the printer will take after voiding a label. Right now, it's set to void a label and then reprint it. Save files is storing the images of the failed labels onto the printer. So usually, you want to have that enabled. And then lastly, we have the void pattern. Right now, it's just set to diamond.